Hey everybody, it's Alika Lifty, and today let's brew our Ethiopia Whoosh Whoosh Low O2 Process Coffee as an espresso offering. So, Whoosh Whoosh, the region in Ethiopia, not the varietal. If you watch the filter video, you'll learn a little bit about that. This coffee still exhibits some of the characteristics that we associate with the Whoosh Whoosh varietal. So we're gonna get really bright acidity. With the low O2 processing, this can be a little overpowering as an espresso. So, this recipe today, we're gonna try to mitigate some of that espresso. We're gonna try to really extract this coffee so that this espresso is not like punching us in the face. So, we are gonna be using a lower dose, high yield, and this is really nice in a cortado, so small amount of milk. We're gonna be brewing with only 18 grams of our whoosh whoosh. We're gonna be pulling 50 grams out. And this should take around 24 to 27 seconds. So, relatively lower dose than we traditionally do. The texture is actually still pretty nice, even at this high yield, low dose. When our shot pulls too fast, it's really, really sour and pretty salty. When it pulls too long, uh, it's still pretty sour and the texture doesn't feel as nice. It feels more drying, kind of chalky. But when we are balanced, we get that bright citrus acidity. Uh, we get nice uh, plum, so some of that malic. Um, it's really like green apple and plum, and uh, like citrus sugar, which isn't necessarily a real thing unless we're talking about like oleosaccharum stuff, but I'm not gonna get into that either. Uh, but like think really like citrus oil, but really sweet. In milk, it still acts really nice. prefer whole milk and these smaller amounts because it's going to cover some of the acidity. You know, this fat is gonna help us mute some of that acidity. We're gonna get nice almonds. We get a pretty good cup of coffee. Especially this tiny dose, we really lose it if we try larger milk drinks. But here in Cortado, it's very nice. Serve and enjoy.